going to show you how to use our large teddy mould. First of all, just dust it with a little corn flour and tap out the excess. I've coloured some of our sugar paste brown and made a smooth sausage. I've coloured it with paste colour, brown paste colour. So I'm starting to press it into the mould, push between two fingers to get it up into the ears, press very firmly over the snout and nose area so you get the detail when the paste is released. If you haven't got our sugar paste, you can use any other sugar paste, but you will need to add flour paste to it about half and half. Or alternatively, you can use CMC or Tylo powder kneaded into your sugar paste. That is level with the back of the mould and it's not coming over the edges of the mould. The paste actually weighs 70 grams. Turn over and release onto the worktop. And there's your teddy bear ready to dust and colour. I'm rubbing pink powder really well into a dusting brush so there's no loose powder. Rub that into the teddy bear's ears, onto the sides of his snout, onto his paws. It's better to build the colour up gradually so you get the right amount onto the bear rather than put too much on that you can't take off. If I rub that again to get rid of as much powder as possible or just get a clean brush and then you can remove any excess corn flour that you don't want to see. Now you can leave the teddy bear like this or you can snip him with scissors. I'm going to paint his eyes and nose in later. I'm going to snip him with scissors for a fair effect. So these are cuticle scissors from Tesco. You just lay the scissors onto the paste. You don't need to press hard. Just lay on top of the paste and snip. The scissors are laying on the paste flat, not at this angle. Just lay the tip of the scissors flat onto the paste and snip like this. Work your way down the bear. I always start from the top and snip in the direction the fur would be going. You can go round the ears. When you've snipped, before the paste dries, you can sort of push out the fur if you want to, make it stand out a little bit more. I'll just turn him to snip and just work your way down the bear. I'm not going to finish all this because I want to paint his nose and eyes. I'll show you the finished bear in a second or two. So I'm going to paint the eyes and the nose. I've mixed alcohol with black powder colour. Paint the eyes. The eyes are sticking out, so it makes it nice and easy to paint. And then paint in the nose. If you haven't got isopropyl alcohol, like I'm using, you can use vodka or gin. Or, again, you can use water, but it will take longer to dry. Now we want a little bit of white onto the brush. And just paint a little dot of white into the bear's eyes. That's his face painted. I'll show you the finished bear now. Now on, the, on your left side you'll see the bear you know, that isn't snipped as it comes out of the mould and painted and on your right side you can see the bear that's been snipped and I've added a bow from our bow mould to that bear.